So today I am going to be making some Cavaletti crosses. They look real nice. So I've already practiced this because I hate wasting materials, especially when I pay for them myself. So while I've been making my wash box over there, I had some like cut offs and stuff like that. So I was like, what can I do? So I made one pair of Cavaletti crosses and they turned out great. So I was like, I'm always seeing on like these um, equestrian poll Facebook pages, what do you use? <laughs> I was like, what do I use? So I thought I would share how to make them. So first of all, you are going to need a length of wood. So I have three inch by one and a half inch by 2.4 meters. And I have got five of those. The reason I have five is because I didn't want any waste. So I wanted basically to be able to buy as many to make whole pieces rather than having like 10 centimeters left or something like that. So I made it to a whole, whole piece. So one Cavaletti cross takes one meter of wood. I can hear my horse and see him in the reflection. Um, so <laughs> takes one piece of wood. So you need four lots of 10 centimeters and then two lots of 30 in the wood lengths. So there's your one meter, 40, six. Yeah, got it. 40, 30 is 30, so that's all right. So one lot, so 2.4 meters times five, 12 meters. So there is my nice round, round lot. So that makes me six pairs of Cavaletti crosses or 12 one raised sides. <laughs> I've got a lot of poles now, so I could have done with it. So what you are going to need is a saw. Handy things about saws, you can use them as a 90 degree and then use a pen to draw a straight line. Before this, I did not know that. Like before adulting, I didn't know that. You're going to need a tape measure. Yeah, tape measure. I sometimes call it a measuring tape and my dad gets mad at me. Um, if you aren't stable enough, you can use a clamp. I'm also stubborn, so it really depends on the mood or how annoyed I get. You're going to need a drill with, like if you're using Phillips screwdriver, like screws, which is the cross. I've got, so I've got a cross piece. You're also going to need a drill because you're going to be wanting to drill pilot holes because you don't want to be splitting your wood. So there's that. And then exterior screws. That is vital because you can put exterior screws internal, but you can't put internal screws external because they don't work. They break and rust and just, no, we don't do that. So, got all our stuff. Explained it, kind of. Let's go. saw those 10 centimeter sections and then I'm going to put my pilot holes in and then we'll attach one put the width in attach the other saw off the end so then it is as accurate as possible and then we shall see <laughs> got some quail eggs and uh, they hatched underneath one of our old chickens and Berry, the beloved Berry, the little grey one that shot past in my barn vlog, my barn revamp, um, she like attacked and killed, t well attacked one and like gruesome last night. We've lost one so we don't know if she ate it 
and then like we've been having problems all day so had her kicked out and then left one of the chicks and um it's now down my bra so we're gonna work with that so this is ollie my baby cat the closest thing i have to a child to date and then we have bouncer which is my big baby and now we have my quail never expected to be a mum so young <laughs> drilled you can start off so it's now flush at the end kind of and then if you put so that's where your next piece is going to go so then you're going to want to screw it in and then you can remove this piece so then when you come to overlap them together you definitely know it's gonna fit Sweet. Ta -da! now it's done you can saw using this face going down so that is one complete half so just imagine you get the other you get another one exactly like that and then you just slot it together to make an x <laughs> I just need to draw some pilot holes there and on the underside of the other corners and put those screws in and we are nice and secure but do you see the point of pilot holes they're just so easy to put screws in Sink it in. Boom. I think that is a job well done, in my opinion, so... I will spend tomorrow to do, like, finish the rest off. It would have been quicker tonight, but the quail drama. If you like it, like and subscribe. Tell me if you've done it. Any other ways you've made cavaletti, like pole raiser ideas. <sighs> I'd need to grade in here. But yeah, I shall see you next time.